Hey guys, TKC here, the Kajido channel, and I'm here with a box opening of the new Kajido set, V5 Mystics. Awesome stuff. New set, hasn't been a new set in a very long time, so it's very nice to finally get back to cracking packs. Lots of really cool cards in here. I already did a set premiere yesterday, it was a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and see what the box opener is, or not the box opener, the box topper, I should say. Oh, and it is... Swift Regen. Awesome stuff. Really, really cool absolute spell. I think this is actually my third. I got two at the set premiere, so that's pretty nice, I guess. And we have all the packs over here that we will gladfully open for you guys. So let's start with this side right here. Okay, first pack. A lot of really good cards in this set. It's really cool. So we got Restrain, we got Terrafan Clinger, Cerulean Core, Saucerhead Shark, Rib Collector, which is Skull Cutter. And we have Fornax the Juggernaut as the rare. Cool stuff. And, oh, right, another Hollow. We have Radiant Purification, another absolute spell. This is the light one. Very, very cool stuff. And uh, we have Blaze Helix and Tothing Totem. Cool. So we have Juggernaut as a rare. All right. Awesome. And we also have Swift Regen as another Hollow. Uh, the thing I noticed is that these packs are like a lot harder to open. I don't know why, but I find it a lot harder to open these. Captive Squill, Eager Cleaver. This is like the most talked about card in the vanillas. It's just like, what the heck is this thing? It's an evil toy with, you know, a bunch of weird stuff. Sawtooth Cyclone, Seed Pod Puffer, MVP in my sealed, by the way. Waylay, Broodmother is the rare. Sweet. Uh, Neural Helix. Solar Helix, and Nightmare Helix, awesome stuff. Three Helix in one pack, that's gonna happen a lot. It's kinda like the birds in Dragon Strike, and the Evos in Evo Fury, you'll see that a lot. <laughs> it's very funny when it happens. All right, so we have Vengeful Blast, a really sick card in Seal. It's only a common, minus 4,000 Shield Blast, really good stuff. The Disassembler, Rampage! Break shield and stuff when you win a battle. Awesome. Terrafan Clinger. Uh, Beacon Drone. This is kind of cool. When it gets banished, you untap something. Uh, Jarbala Swordbreaker. Uh, here's a rare. Luminous Shield Wing. This is a card a lot of people are talking about. Um, it can go very well in Enforcer Rush decks. It's a level 2, so you can evolve on it, but you probably wouldn't want to because when it gets banished, it goes in your shield zone, so it's very nice to have. Uh, Arcane Warden, another really sick blocker. And Verdant Helix, another awesome Helix. Pretty good start so far, but of course you want to see some uh, supers. And oh my god, this happened again. Okay, look, this, this is literally the second or third time this has happened to me. It's really hard to see, but I opened the pack and the plastic ripped from the base of the pack or something. This is like the second time this has happened to me. So it's just like, how do you open these packs when it does this? Like. What the heck? So then I go from the bottom, and I hope it doesn't do the same thing on that side. There you go. It's okay. <laughs> anyway, Blue Scale Dracon, another uh, really cool card that can be used in uh, Dracon Rush, because it's a protector, so you can protect your Dracon Evos. Uh, Lightning Sniper, Seed Pod Puffer. Uh, Restrain's really cool. It's kind of like an upgrade to Detain, in a way. Uh, you tap a 4,000 power creature or less for just one, so that's pretty useful in aggressive decks. Sawtooth Cyclone. Oh, we got another um, rare here, but this is the Mystic of Water. So if you haven't uh, heard already, um, the Mystics are actually foil because they match with the um, the foil spell that matches their sieve. Um, so it, it gets kind of confusing because you see a rare, but it's foil, and you're like, what? How is this happening? And then like the next card is most probably a foil. Oh, it's not. Okay, never mind. But if there was a foil, you'd be like, ooh, I got two foils in the same pack, but really you just got like a rare and a foil, I guess you can say. But yeah, Mystic of Water, really good Mystic. Cool stuff. Uh, Nightmare Helix, Hypergrid Hacker, and Spark Spine Lizard. Oh, it almost happened again. The, the pack plastic thing. Alright. Data Assembler, Eager Cleaver, Saucerhead Shark, Labinator 3000. Oh, and uh, someone pointed on the dojo that Fruit Parfait is uh, the illustrator name. You probably can't see it, but uh, yeah, Fruit Parfait, good stuff. 
uh, Lightning Sniper, and wow, back to back Mystic of Water openings, cool. Can we get the water spell with it? Liquid Compulsion? No, nope. dang it. Um, but yeah, this is not a foil, I should put that in the rears. Uh, Octobot Infiltrator, uh, a really cool card for Corrupted, I've already talked about it on the channel. Um, Doom Cannon Mech, pretty cool. You untap for the first time, just like Onslaught Trooper, but this one's a protector. Neat stuff. Uh, Night Haunt, uh, it's a bigger Skeeter Swarmer. That's kind of cool too. I'm telling you, man, these packs are just so hard to open. It's crazy. They really, like, sealed these shut. Alright, we got Seed Pod Puffer, Rib Collector, Beacon Drone, Blade Mane. It's a Tusker Bait for Noble Rumbling Pterosaur. I'm so excited, because now I could maybe make a deck out of it. I don't know, we'll see. Uh, Sawtooth Cyclone, Death Tongue Leech, another cool Corrupted. Uh, we got Nightmare Helix, Solar Helix, Taunting Totem, and a Code Card. Yep, Code Cards uh, still exist. Uh, the online game uh, is still up and running, and uh, they did say in a recent Reddit AMA that I highly suggest you check out to get some more details on what's going on in Kaijudo. Um, they got some uh, interesting details about the online game. They plan to uh, improve it in the future. Uh, here's another comment I want to talk about. Captain Orwellia. Kind of cool. It's an Aquin that makes both players draw a card. Uh, you know, pluses are always nice, I guess. Uh, I mean, you're plusing your opponent too, but when you're using an aggressive deck, uh, you don't really care about the cards in their hand, you just care about keeping your own hand up and just getting rid of their shield as fast as possible. So I think this is an interesting choice for tempo, but uh, anyway, it's pretty cool. Just wanted to point that out. Vengeful Blast. Wele! 2,000 power or less creature gets banished for only two and a shield blast. Really good. Uh, here's the rare, Harbinger of the Void. Really awesome because this is the first level 5 Terror Dragon. So this is really nice for Corvus Dragon from, I believe it was Invasion Earth. It's a light darkness uh, Celestial Dragon or Terror Dragon Evo and it does a lot of cool things. So uh, I think that'll be really cool uh, to test out with Corvus. Uh, it's another Spark Spine Lizard. Which is kind of funny. When you have multiple Spark Spine Lizards, they have fast attack and 2,000 more power. Or powerful attack? No, powerful attack 2,000. And Verd Helix. Alright, that pack was a lot easier to open. Captive Squill, Disassembler, Collector, Cyclone, Blue Skill Dracon, another Mystic. We have the Mystic of Nature. Really big. 5,000 for 4. Awesome. Uh, Hypergrid Hacker, Arcane Warden, and Scourge Lord. Uh, another kind of cool one. Uh, you banish, not banish, you discard two cards out of your opponent's hand when you attack. So it's like King Nautilus, but discard. It's interesting. And Arcane Warden is really cool too. The big blocker thing. Okay, so only one foil so far. That's kind of uh, disappointing. Uh, hopefully we get a lot more in the other side of the pack. Um, Lavinator 3000, Seed Pod Puffer, Terrifying Clinger, Cerulean Core, Jarbala Swordbreaker. Uh, Twilight Worm, this is kind of cool, it's the first Slayer blocker ever. It's kind of unfortunate it's a level 5 though, but still really, really cool. And alright, another Swift Regeneration. This makes 4 Swift Regenerations total. Crazy stuff. Uh, it'd be nice if I could get the other spells at some point. <laughs> Haven's Command. And um, Sledge Flail. Oh, Hayden's Command is really cool too. Um, it's a lot like Defense Mode, where you give one of your creatures um, Blocker, and you give it Skirmisher at the end of the turn. But the more relevant part is the fact that you can use this on your opponent's creatures too, whereas Defense Mode was just on your own. And when you do it on your opponent's creature, you give them Skirmisher, so they can't attack. They can only attack creatures. So, it's a very cool, uh, versatile uh, spell. And uh, Sledgefoot's a kind of cool one too. It's a skirmisher with a big body, and when you win a battle with it, you break two shields. Cool stuff. There's a lot of uh, trample uh, stuff in here. Uh, that's basically what trample is in a way, I guess. Like trample and magic is you do damage uh, to the opponent when you do more damage to the monster or something like that. Um, but yeah, you break shields when you do battles. It's cool stuff. Beacon drone, blade main, lightning sniper, saucer shark, eager cleaver, more cast of defiant. The Slumbering Titan, but for fire. Night Haunt, Octobot Infiltrator, Spark Spine Lizard. So the commons and uncommons you'll kind of see a lot because there's not very many. The set's very small, it's only 60 compared to the 90 card sets and the 120 or more card sets. Uh, we have Rampage here, Captain Orwellia, Blue Skill Dracon, 
Jarball Swordbreaker, the Disassembler, the Rare is Vectron Crawler, and I do see a Super Rare, but let's talk about Vectron Crawler to kind of make things a bit more surprising. Uh, Vectron Crawler is cool, pretty cool. When you attack, you draw a card if they block, and if they don't block, you banish a 3,000 or less. So it kind of like forces them to block, and then you draw a card. Uh, you get like a lot of weird pluses off this. I think this is going to be really interesting in tempo. But anyways, enough of that. The Super Rare is the Mystic of Light. Cool, so now I have the... Radiant Purification to go with it. Such nice art. Really nice. Awesome stuff. I got the Wind Condition card. Hacker and Doom Cannon Mech. So I think at this point you've seen all of the commons and uncommons. Uh, so now it's just a matter of fact of uh, seeing all the rares and stuff and maybe supers. Lavinator, Blade Main, Captive Squill, Lightning Sniper, Vengeful Blast, The Mystic of Fire. Burn the Shield. Woohoo. Scourge Lord, Arcane Warden, Sledgefoot. Alright, off to the next side of packs. So right now we only have four foils. Hopefully we get a lot more now. A good four or five at least. Oops, almost dropped a bunch of cards there. Rib Collector, Beacon Drone, Seed Pod Puffer, Sawtooth Cyclone, Waylay, Terrafan Clinger, Morkaz the Defiant once again, Arcane Warden, and Bird Helix. I'm pretty much breezing through these next packs because I'm more interested in the rares, very rares and super rares. Restrain, Orwellia, Cleaver, Dracon, Blade Main, Mystic of Darkness. Alright, so that's like, I believe almost all the, the Mystic. Actually, no, that is all the Mystics right there. Uh, we have uh, Fire, Nature, Darkness, Two Waters, and the Light Mystic. So I'll uh, go ahead and sort those all out eventually, but yeah, cool. Scourge Lord, Neural Helix, Doomcan Mech. Here, so we got Waylay. Waylay, I just I love that name. It's just so funny. You just like repeat it. Just like Waylay, lay, 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 Vengeful Blast, Saucer Red Shark, Disassembler, Landing Sniper, Rampage, Rare is Death Tongue Leech. Yep, Octavia Infiltrator and uh, Blaze Helix. Actually, I don't know if we got Blaze Helix yet, but this card is really cool. Uh, all the Helix spells are actually really cool, uh, but this one's just really nice. Banishing all blockers or attacking all untapped creatures. Very strong ability. Come on, pack. Oh. Barely opened that one. Poor packs. I'm just like massacring them. Oh well. Jarbala, Iga Kriva, Restrain, Blade Main, Squill. Oh yes, this big potato over here. Magma Clism Rex. King of Potatoville with a karate flaming fist thing. Yeah, it triple breaks. That's pretty nice. Uh, ooh, we got another absolute spell. The absolute darkness you cannot see anymore. Um, yeah, really good card. Minus 6,000 to everything. Can't block. Very strong. Haven's Command and Spitting... Uh, not Spitting Totem. Uh, Taunting Totem. Seed Pod Puffer, Cerulean Core, Orwellia, Rip Collector, Blue Skeletron, another Mystica Fire, Spark Spine Lizard, Verdant Helix, and Night Haunt. I think we've almost seen all the rares too. I think we might be missing a multi sim one, like uh, Fornax. That's, that's another one I'd like to talk about, I guess. Uh, Rampage, Turfan Clinger, Sawtooth, Lavinator, Beacon, what's the rare? Another Luminous Shieldwing, and I believe we have another super rare here, so let's go ahead and check out what it is. Oh, it is Soul Devour, Black Feather, a really, really cool card. I really love this uh, Summer Champs watermark here, it's really nice. Um, I really, really like this card. I think it has so much potential. And Oh, actually, we did get a Fornax, never mind. Uh, anyway, <laughs> uh, yeah, Soul Devour. Um, I have a really cool idea with this, and I'll have to post it as a deck profile at one point, but uh, yeah, very, very fun card. Uh, Solar Helix and Nightmare Helix, another really cool card. Nightmare Helix is another card that's very strong. Okay, we got Jarbala, Vengeful, Waylaylaylay, Restrain, Squill, Quinn Riptide, actually that's another way we haven't seen. Uh, this is kind of nice. Uh, it has the magic ability of Scrying, which is like King Alberan, actually. Or uh, the new dragon, um, uh, what's the name? Koani Dragon Oracle, I believe it's called. 
Uh, but yeah, Queen Riptide, when it comes into play, or when you attack, you look at the top card and then choose to either keep it on top of your deck or put it on the bottom. Um, another really good card in uh, Sealed, uh, you control your draws, look for the card you need. Uh, very, very strong. Haven's Command, Sledgefoot, and Hypergrid Haka. There are now five packs left. We've gotten, let's see, six foils. So I think we have potential of getting at least two more, hopefully. Uh, Rampage, Cerulean Core, Orwellia, Terrafan Clinger, Blue Scale Dracon. Oh, here's another one. Salem Skysworn. Another uh, cool card uh, to add to um, some sort of dragon's list, maybe even with Corvus. It's just really big, it blocks, and you'll probably not attack with this. But if they have no creatures on the field, you might as well go ahead and swing. It's a double breaker. But if they have creatures on the field, you cannot attack the shields. You can only attack creatures. But that's fine too. You can just like you know tap their creatures and get rid of it with this 7,500 body. Really cool. Um, and ooh, we got the spell of Liquid Compulsion. Sweet. So I think the only spell we're missing now is the Absolute Incineration from Fire. That would be nice to get. I actually hope I pull one of those. Um, we'll see. Uh, Neural Helix and Blaze Helix. Four more packs. So I'm hoping for either another super like Rusalka or Sargon. That would be kind of cool. Or even Hamongaru. Um, but yeah, I kind of want the absolute incineration really bad. Oh, I think I see another super here. Uh, Rare's Twilight Worm. What is the super? I'm gonna guess. I have a weird feeling it's gonna be Hamongaru. Let's go ahead and see. Oh, it's like a prayer of Sulka. Yeah, awesome stuff. So now we have the two Summer Champs Super Rares. These are just really cool. Um, good job, Wizards, and good job to the people at Summer Champs who made these elegant cards. They're just, oh, they're so beautiful. I love the Rusalka. It's very nice. Um, we have Neural Helix and Doom Cannon Mech. All right, so I, I think it's safe to say there's no more foils left, but... Who knows, a miracle can happen, and I can get Absolute Incineration, and this will probably be like the best box I could have ever hoped for. Lavinator, Cerulean Core, Shark, Wailelele, Rib Collector, Mystic of Nature, and Squirt Lord, and Arcane Warden, and Sledgefoot. Alright. Two more packs. Second to last pack here. Come on. Captive Squill, Vengeful Blast, this Disassembler, Blade Mane, Eager Cleaver, Queen Riptide number two. Oh dang, another Liquid Compulsion. Dang, I really hope that was an absolute incineration. But that's awesome too. That's a lot of foils actually. Cool stuff. Blaze Helix and Taunting Totem. One more pack here. And I highly doubt it is a foil, but I'm still going to open it. Just to see what's in there. And this pack is another one of those packs. Oh, I just dropped all the cards. Awesome. Last pack is going to end with a big finish of dropping all the cards and I have to play. Nine card pickup because the code card doesn't count. Um, all right, Saucer Edge Shark, Lavinator, Cerulean Core, Swordbreaker, Lightning Sniper, Salem Sky Sworn is the rare, and nope, no more foils like I thought. Octobot, David's Command, and Night Haunt. Good stuff, guys. This is a really, really nice, really, really nice box. Uh, let me go ahead and pull out all the Mystics here, at least one of each, because I actually did get one of each, believe it or not. Um, what else is there? The Water Mystic. Alright, so we have the five Mystics over here. Really cool. We have Light, Water, Darkness, Fire, Nature. There you go. There's the five Mystics. Really beautiful. And, of course, you got the spells to go with them. That also feels really cool. I just, they, they, I love how they match up. It's such a smart idea from Wizards. Really cool. Yep, this is a really, really, really nice box. I got the Mystic of Light, I got the two Summer Champs um, supers, really nice, and then the foils, well, of course, they're all Mystics and spells and stuff, but the spells I got, I got one Light one, I got two Water, uh, kind of all upside down and stuff, uh, no, that's a Mystic, <laughs> one Darkness, and two Nature, so now I'm just missing Fire, but I have a bunch of other boxes to open, so I'm going to go ahead and enjoy those. So thank you all for watching. This is TKC, the Kaiju channel, signing off. Enjoy the five mystics. See you later, guys. Peace.